Assalamualaikum and welcome back again. So now, um, we just write here possible family. Um, Sunny R. Aslama. Okay, Samia Aslama, yeah, both. Mm -hmm. so don't write the self right now. We will we will see first. Yeah. yeah. But it, it is to reject in Aslama family to in the Asamia family it means unfamiliar. Yeah. He felt mm -hmm. unfamiliar. Uh, uh, yes, I, I have a question that how to identify that uh, like between the Asamia and Asma uh, Aslama family. Like it's a it's a kind of big question. <laughs> yeah, we, question. we will see we will search some more uh, places yeah. for this inshallah. We'll do more, yeah. Uh, yeah. Just guess yeah. work, yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> right. Okay. So the other word uh, that needs of is kazdaba. Uh, we do often. Mm -hmm. and then the other one is kana yeah yes so we don't i don't think we need to do that and the rest is harf so we can do the grammar now based mm -hmm. on the translation what kind of wow is here Mm -hmm. And so it is just half out of here. Mm -hmm. And then la. La yeah. of emphasis. Mm. There is no, it's not shown in the translation. Yeah, no, no, lahat is, uh, no, lahat is something that comes when it comes with the madi, it means already. And when it comes with the mudori, it is something. Uh, it's, uh, it is in the it, mm. so lakad you lakad think itself. Good? Yeah, itself means the already when it comes to the madi as mm -hmm. it is there in the translation yeah so yeah. it is already yeah, yeah. Okay. and and what happened if it is in mudori uh, I don't actually remember. Uh, you can even go for the textbook and see. Uh, it maybe might or something like that. I don't actually, like exactly okay. remember that. Okay, but it's different meaning, yeah. That's the... Yeah, when it comes with the Madi, it it has different meaning. When it comes with the Mudori, it has different meaning. Mm -hmm. So it is not Lama and Lama emphasize or something like that. It's a one word Lafat. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Lakot. Lakot is one word then, Hana. Lakot is one word? Mm -hmm. Yeah, not... you, if you want, you can look for, look for the textbook also. You, you, you saw in the textbook that Lakot is one word? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Even Ustaz said that in the classes. Yeah, they can, yeah. Maybe three, four times Ustaz yeah. mentioned that. Oh, okay. with me. What page is it? You can see in the Joomla Filia, maybe. Oh. In the textbook, Jumla Filia, Lakat. Lakat. Yeah, I remember too. It can it can be one word. In Aspanahu, it also mentioned it. Sister also mentioned it in Aspanahu. I just cannot remember. What page? I don't remember the page. You can go for the Joomla Filia in like uh, just basic now Joomla Ismi or Joomla Filia. It's, oh, it's wow. in the beginning of the class, like beginning. Yeah, it is there in the beginning of Joomla Filia. Chapter Anna, can, Joomla Filia. Can you search on uh, like in general for the whole document and you just write the word Laka, then it will come? Oh, yeah, and, yeah. And yeah. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. I, I, I remember it is in the Joomla Filia only, in the chapter Joomla Filia. No, no, I'm saying something else. Yeah. 
Uh, this is the we won't find this like like this i am not sure we can mm. find this is um uh, it will take time yeah let me just look here you can uh search in your own sister and then you can share with us inshallah god god so we have god here Day twenty five. Let's mm -hmm. check. Quad how? Wakad. I'm translating wakad. It's not lakad. The one that Ustad mentioned in the class is wakad. As one package, having already or having just. Not lakad. We can see maybe there yeah, is more about yeah, in this translation it said already had. So that's good enough. Already yeah. had wa, 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 okay. Yeah, there is no more about God here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hmm. Okay. So what Ustad mentioned in the class is wa qad. It's not lakad. So the question is now. Lam is on its own or it attached to the quad as one word. Sister uh, Asma said this is one word, lakad. But please do search more um, and you can um, share with us what page it is so we can uh, take a look together. But for now, let's um thinking this lamb as lamb emphasize yeah we can change uh, anytime you know mm -hmm. La, oh, if this is in fact uh, one word then we just change this what is this half Kazaba is Prima B. I know as a Nipa, I love me. So we would like for outside the world, yeah. Madina is a Mosul, the statue here figure out, inshallah, and it is plural, masculine, and proper. What is that? Anna, what's that? Was a Nipa, Allah, not family. It's meaning from family. Yeah. Oh, what? I oh, I see. oh, I see. You got shada. I didn't see the shada. Okay, so it is alama, yeah. Hmm. Yes. Okay. I didn't. I thought it is an kata. No. Although is special mother him wamir mutasil 
is jar plural masculine and proper ka uh, here is and again and already had thus before them denied and and how what kind of n is this apa and means for apa the fa the fa is an n in here fa is uh, they translated as and here yeah yeah because yeah. yeah. fa is an n it could be n it could be so it could be so many things if it is so and then and therefore then it will pass over here if it is has a uh, tough then it will translate it as and yes. okay uh, is her is this is the form am mm -hmm. i write it correctly yeah the same like yesterday yeah yeah Rana. If the anali anawazani nafara wala miruhu huwa, we look for outside the world too. And like we, oh, actually we should uh, add one more. Yeah. Hmm. Because if this is actually mudaf and mudaf ilai, like in yeah. the previous uh, ayah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then this. This should be a rocker. Um, we just put this status rocker one as a family. Still, we don't know. So, because this is the easiest here, can need um, two percent. It is need isem kana. It should be rafa and after. Then we have nakiru, rafa, and comes after. Kana. So together, this is idrafa. And it's in kana, ya. Yeah? It's in kana. And then, kana and its ism always uh, move to that. Yes. And kaifa. Oh, so we have move to that more after, yeah? Yes. More mm -hmm. And here, um, khabar. Mukaddam, just like in the previous ayah. Mm -hmm. So this is jumlah isminya. Okay. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullah. Ada bunda ya? Yeah. Okay. Jumlah isminya. Isminya. Okay. Then. Go back again. Wa la qad al harf. The main word here is kadaba. It is huwa. Should we look for um outside the world? Okay, so uh, I figured it out in day nineteen. Okay, sorry, mm -hmm. Anna, I interrupted you. So yeah. we have done in day nineteen. Lakat kafar al ladina kalu inna Allah huwa al Masiul ibn Maryama. Mm -hmm. uh, we we are doing an ayah. So here, Ustad, Lakad plus Kafara. Yeah. So he said that Lakad is Lam plus Kad. Okay, that's good. Mm -hmm. So certainly, I swear, this is what yeah. he has given the translation of. Because I remember that uh, Ustad said that these are two words separate. Mm -hmm. so, yes. Yeah. So, so he said that certainly, I swear. So. If we are saying certainly, I swear, means that lam is for emphasis or for swearing, maybe. 
No, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, Amra, yes, you are right. Uh, uh, like lam and khat are different words. When khat comes with the madi, it is having a diff like different meaning. When khat comes with the mudori, it is having a different meaning. I just looked in the textbook. Okay. So what what it's on the textbook, is it? What reads on the textbook? Okay, just... just, just but, but, yeah. Me. So because this is it's, coming uh, on page page eighty three. Oh, page eighty three from the basic novel. Yeah, it's in basic. This is my own. Oh, eighty three. Okay, so. Oh, sister Amna, what ayah it it's again? I don't know the ayah, Hana. Because I did not write any ayah. I just write the whole ayah which Ustad did with us. It has shart. So we were doing the shart and job with shart, I think. This is That's page... why we did it. Okay. This is page... Yeah, the, I, I see it now on page 83. Cut plus madi is half already. It's in on the table. Chapter 7 of vocabulary. Chapter 7. Mm-hmm. Not, not page 83 of this page 83 of the book. Not page 83 of the page. Okay, so Lisa, tell me what is it? Tell us what is it? What is written? It's a hot, hot plasma D, like what Sister Asma was saying. Yeah, hot plasma D meaning have already. Mm -hmm. Hot plasma dori meaning certainly. So if it's modori, then it is what you're saying that it is an emphasis. But with it is a madi, it means have already. Ah, chapter okay. seven. Chapter seven vocabulary. And the start here, he he translate he translated with uh past tense, like with madi. He mm -hmm. said certainly over here. <clears throat> no. Well, <laughs> sometimes he sometimes he make a mistake too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you look on the Chapter 7, vocabulary, which is page 83 of the text, which is could be page 93, I don't know. This is chapter 7. Seven vocab, yeah. Chapter 7, vocabulary at the top is not that one. All the first. Chapter 7, vocabulary is page 83. Ah, that, it's at the top is... Uh, Go down, Hana. Maybe there is something down. Yeah, further down, maybe it's in... Lam, lama. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. That's, that's the one, yeah. But there, I've already looked. Cut plus madi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Here, here, here. Cut plus mudare and plus, cut plus madi. Thank you, Sister Asma. You are right. <laughs> okay. It is the basic. <laughs> yeah, that's why. Mm, so it, that's why it, the translation have already or had already, yeah, not emphasis. No, no, it is emphasis because lam and kad are different. They are two separate. It's not one word. I know, but in, in madi, it's kot plus madi. Oh, it's got the line. No, no, yeah. no. No, no, no. Lam is for emphasis. Yeah, yeah. Kad mm -hmm. plus madi mm -hmm. is have and already. Yeah, yeah. That's but right. lam is for emphasis. Yeah. So it... In here, it doesn't say la cot, it just say cot, yeah? Yeah. That's but it certainly is not one word, yeah? Two words. Yeah. Okay, so it is two words, mm -hmm. okay? The one that can be translated as one word is wa cot. Okay. Um, I. Mm -hmm. you can translate as one. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Here in Advanced Nahu, day twenty-five. Mm-hmm. No. Okay, the khala wa qad akala. 
Mm -hmm. I'm not translating the wa as an. I'm translating wakod as one package as having already. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So need to be careful mm -hmm. when we have wakod. Hey, Hannah, can you just hold on a second? I will write it. Mm, okay. Good to, yeah. It is not two things happen at the same time. It is two things happen almost at the same time. So oh. There are two things, but still they are happening at the same time, right? No, no, no. not happen. Almost, almost, almost at the same time. No, no, it's written that... Uh, it's not two things happen at the same time. It's two things happen almost at the same time. Yeah, so yeah. there are two things, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wa is separate and kad is separate. But when they are together, then we translate it as having already. Yeah. When it comes with the wow. Yeah. They are separate. And or happening at the same time. Uh -huh. Almost at the same time, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. You also should uh, look at, you know, the other word like because here we have uh fi'il waqad and fi'il again so maybe that's um a fact also yeah waqad and madi and waqad and madare this is what you call no 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 because uh you you can say waqad as n already because um yeah. Okay, so Ustad in one ayah, Ustad is translating its ayah number uh, in Surah Nisa. Uh, yeah. Here, so another we, example, Waqad. Here, in this example, Waqad is translated as while. Yeah, yeah, he's, uh, yeah. yeah. here also he translated as Waqad means while already been. Mm -hmm. uh, while already oh, yeah. been. Mm. Oh. oh, yeah. But yeah, yeah, maybe it depends on the context that uh, it may be uh, like if it is hal or something like that. Mm -hmm. It depends on such kind of things. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, oh, the context. Uh, I don't. May, I don't know about the hal, but it is with the wow. That's why it is kind of a. No, no, no. I'm talking about the wild kind of thing. Just oh, yeah. both, both, both are wa both are hal, but it can be translated as uh, having already, or it can translate as a while. So mm -hmm. you know, in yeah. one case you have uh, two things happen at the same time, and in one case you have two things happen almost at the same time. This is mm -hmm. using the same word wakod. So how you translate it is depend. You know, you should look at the words around it. Mm -hmm. mm. So yeah. Anyway, let's come back to yeah, our so good, good revision. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Alhamdulillah. So we have uh min qabli him is jarwa majrur. Mm -hmm. okay. Jarwa majrur. And it's come after um is a mausul. What comes after is mausul is silatul mausul, and silatul mausul should be a sentence. So we have here jarwa majrur. So typically, yeah, uh, jarwa majrur and mudaf and mudaf ilai, but it still come uh, fall into one bucket jarwa majrur, yeah. Yeah? Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Typically, when we have jarwa majrur after uh, is mausul, there mm -hmm. there is a uh, mubtada mahzub, there is hidden mubtada. So actually we have huwa min qablihim or whom min qablihim in this case because alladhina uh, the pronoun inside it is whom it's plural masculine what pronoun whom so the mubtada mahzub here is whom whom min qablihim hana what we have hidden mubtada Okay. Because you cannot but, only have a fragment as a silatul mausul. Silatul mausul has to be a sentence. So, like the the hidden muktada is uh, the pronoun should match the isa mausul. 
actually yeah because because the pronoun match uh, in the ismausul and it is that's why it is too obvious then it's not being mentioned it's being mahzub mm -hmm. like, mah like, mah 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 okay Maybe you write it down in there. So then home would be like this Allazina home in Kablehim. It should be like that. But home was being removed. Yeah. So it's Allazina min Kablehim. So now Allazina home min Kablehim or Allazina min Kablehim is one like giant Mosulia. Yeah, it's a Mosul Vasila to Mosul. Okay. So this is mm -hmm. so what we said here is muta only be mahzuf. It's it's what is said in Quran at no what is it? Tafsir dot co what Quran? Yeah, sorry. Yeah. You wanna yeah. You can check later. Uh-huh. So, so actually this is jumlah isminya. Mm -hmm. Ini ya. And silatul mausul. Sila al mausul. La. Mahala. Laha. Si. Il. Ya Arab. Oke. Okay. So together, this is Isu Mausul Fasilatuhu. Okay, this is one fragment. It can it can be um fa'il or maf'ul or muta'anik bil fi'il of kadzaba. Let's see the translation. And already had those before them denied. Those before them denied. So this is file, yeah? Yeah, they make it file in the translation. Mm -hmm. So this is oh, file. Too small. Okay. And then this is file. So we have here jumlah fi'liya. Oh, oh, that's beautiful, yeah. <laughs> it's beautiful, yeah. You find, you find the fa'il. <laughs> yeah. So you let's check. Let's check. Olum. Surah. What does all mean again? Knowledge, yeah? Information. Science, information, knowledge, Science. yeah. Oh, oh. Al mulk. Oh. Down, down. Down, yeah. 80. Ya Arab Muyasar. Walakad. Alwaw istinafia. Yeah. Okay. So what Ustaz said about istinafia, it is uh, separate or new, new sentence. Yeah. And wal jumla tu ba ba. Ba'adaha. Mustanafa la mahalalaha min alaa wal alaam matu fil qasam wa qad laam is qasam. Okay. okay, so lam here muta'a muta'a hulil qasam whatever it is, seems like this is lam of emphasize like sister Amna said, yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then waqad harf tahqiq oh ya I forgot, Ustaz mentioned this one, yeah? Tahqiq yeah. What is that? Harf tahqiq uh, 
we can oh. search. Okay, okay. we will find out later, insyaAllah. And kazaba fi an madi al-lazina. Okay. Yeah, fail. We are correct. And then min khabihim si jarwa majrur muta'anniqani bi mahzufi. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, meaning there is hidden um, muktada. Oh, hidden muktada. Yeah. Silatul mausul. Fajumlatul silatul la mahalalaha fil a'rab. Fakaifa alfa'u harf ataf. Yes, we are correct. Wa kaifa isim istifham fi mahalli nasab. Oh. Oh, yeah. Why? Oh, yeah. Because khabar kana. That's why it is yeah. nasab. Oh, yeah. Khabar kana is nasab. Oh, yes. Forgot mm -hmm. one thing. Yeah. Kana fi an mali nafis. Okay. So this is, has nothing to do with nafis in, you know, the week, le week later uh, at the end. This is another case of yeah. nafis. Nakir, okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. Isam ismuha. Oh, isam isam kana, meaning isam kana. Mm -hmm. Wa, I don't know how to read this. Uh, huh. What does that mean? Okay. Too many strange words. I mean that is. <laughs> yeah. This is what I know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> I mean that is. Inkari yeah. alehim. Like. Uh, deny on them. Inkari means deny, like uh, denying on them. Yeah, De -de on them. Denying against them, yeah? Yeah, on them or against them. Yeah. This oh. is very difficult to have it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, but Hana, it's very nice here. Yeah, you, you go to Furkan.co. You, you used to be like no go area for the Furkan dot so I'm so oh, happy yeah. for you. That's yeah, Anna. because Ustad in the what twenty eight maybe he teach us to read in Arab Muyassar. Yeah, yeah. Oh, so we already can do this. Okay, yeah. let's try. <laughs> and also, it is similar with this. We used to use this right Quran Hive. Yeah. And all but also, Quran Hive Arab is a little uh, the Arabic is a little bit easier. Maybe the words are a little bit mm -hmm. familiar. Yeah. With, mm -hmm. with the, the color coded different color, it's easier to see. Okay, let's uh, try and uh, have a look. Nakiri Ismuha meaning Ismukana Marfu. Yeah. Build Dhamma. I, I don't know how to read this. Mukdara. Ala ma kablal ya. Again. Yal mahzufa lil taqsis. Taqsis means deduction. Wa jumla jababu shart. Mukaddar la mahalla laha. Jababu shart. Yeah. So maybe, see, they said the wow harf qasam. Uh, first line, Hana. Oh, yeah. Wow harf qasam. Wajal walam wakya fi jawabul qasam. So they say they are saying that wow is harf qasam and lam is on like wakya means like on the at the same time is jawabul qasam and the qad is harf tahqiq. Qazabal zina madi wa pailu wa jumla jawabul qasam la mahalala. So this is Jawabul Qasam, they are saying. Okay, so from La. Mm -hmm. Okay, so La Qad Kazabal Ladina Min Qablihim is Jawabul Qasam. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, okay, just to reminder, Qasam and Jawabul Qasam meaning oaths. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Okay, so first, I should write here before I forget. Um, what it say again? 
خبر مقدم في محل نسب اه يا خبر مقدم في محل نسب في اي ريدي but hana i think we should uh, like just copy paste this again and let's uh, let's put the analysis of that quran hive over here because i think we have uh, done it correctly maybe uh -huh. yeah because so for the, the, yeah just you mean two 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 version yeah 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 because see when uh, like if we do the uh, this kasam and jawabul kasam Then it, oh, yeah. it will be a very understand and understanding wise it will be very separate thing. This is what uh, I am trying to say. Yeah, you are correct. It affects uh, the translation and how we see. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. And to understand the Quran, the ayah also will be different. But it's uh, yeah. So they are saying that wow is hard fashion. Hmm. Half person. Okay, so here I should put. Um, so, if this is kosm, wajah bul kosm, can it be jumlah ismiya or a fragment? Ah, uh, kosm and wajah bul kosm, the oath, right? Yeah. Like take so a simple. We, when we are saying, like we, if we are saying that vow is as custom, then vow means I swear by, right? Yeah. And la and lakad again, I swear by. I think the grammatical analysis we have done, the fail and the file is correct. You just yeah. need to put put the one more uh, extra row over here, and if we want to do like this, then we just. Put the row and uh, merge from lam to him. Him, sorry, lam to him, and just write jawabul kasam. That's it. Because I don't think so that any other thing will change. The translation would be same. Like I swear by, I swear by. Already the pe the people from before them denied. No, right? Mm -hmm. No. If wow is have kasam, then you have more emphasis. Yeah, yeah. This is what I'm saying. Yeah. So I swear, is... by will come twice. Yeah. I yeah. I swear, by will come twice in the translation. Uh mm huh. -hmm. Yeah. Meaning, still there is difference, right? Yeah. There okay. Is, there is a difference. So we there can just put... not... instead mm -hmm. of make make this is a uh, two version. We can put not here. Uh, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay. Because you know, I have uh, Ustad did some ayahs in the class. Okay, and he used the word "I swear by" or you know, he put the emphasis on the ayah. But when I see the different translations, there were no emphasis over there. Mm, kind of like if there is lakad, so I swear by kind of you know. They did not write like that. Mm -hmm. So maybe it is something that we are doing the Arabic. So Ustad is teaching us that correct way because so many times Ustad all always say that doing the translation of an ayah is very difficult thing because you might miss something just to make it sure, right? Remember, we have done so many ayahs in the Quran, like uh, in the classes. And there are small ayahs, but the translation is kind of two lines, two three lines. So maybe so now we a uh, vow can be her fatha and vow can be fatham, huh? Yeah. Sorry. Because, uh, because if it is vowel custom, then it will be harf uh, jar. Because harf jar is harf fatah is. Uh, remember, we learned when we were learning the harf jar. Oh yeah! How come this is? The so vowel is I swear by. Yeah. And how, it... why? 
have class and a vow can also be uh, and yeah it should 